Pictionary Air 2 from Mattel is an upgrade to the original Pictionary Air, the game where what you draw is in the air. In this version, you get two device holders because you can play the game with two phones or small tablets. One device captures the drawings and the other one reads the clues, or put the two holders together to hold one large tablet. You can even cast to your TV to see your drawings on a bigger screen. And to see more toy and game reviews, click subscribe. The game also comes with a light pen that you use to draw in the air. The pen requires three AAA batteries. You'll also need the free Pictionary Air app to play. Whoever is drawing views their clues on the clue device and then draws with the lighted pen tip facing the device. Hold down the draw button when you want to draw. The pen tip will be green while drawing. You can either draw without seeing the image, which is a challenge, or you can see what you're drawing. Interact with your image if you like, but be sure to not use letters, numbers, sounds, sign language, or dashes to show the number of letters in the word. Whenever your teammates correctly guess your drawing, add a point by pressing the score button on the device. Get your team to guess as many clues as possible before time is up. The game keeps time for you. After the final round, the team with the most points wins. The game is for two teams of players ages 8 and up. Just like all the other Pictionary Air games, this one is a fun test of your drawing skills, though this version is also a little more compact because you don't need to lug around a deck of challenge cards. The clues are provided for you in the app. What do you think of this new version? Let me know in the comments. The pros are drawing in the air is a fun challenge, all of the clues are in the app, and it tests your drawing skills. I really don't have any cons, so I give this game 4.5 stars. For more fun toy videos, follow us on TikTok at The Toy Authority.